hey, it's the Droid Guy here, and we've got an exclusive for you. We are going to go hands-on with some of the features just introduced at WWDC on iOS 5. That's right. Here is a hands-on video with features from iOS 5. Scott Forstall, the Senior Vice President of iOS Software, went on stage today and explained these great features. Let's see them live, exclusive, right here on the Droid Guy's YouTube channel. Here we go. Let's first go over the Notification Center. Wait a second, that doesn't look like an iPhone. It looks like an HTC Sensation 4G, and it's an Android phone. Okay, let's do it anyway. Let's go over the Notification Center. Drop down. Oh my goodness, we have notifications. Let's go and see what they are. I have a voicemail from 805-637-7243. Wait, wait for it, if I push this button, it's going to have me go, call my voicemail. Oh my God, imagine that. Voicemail calling. We don't really want to do this. Let's go back up and check the notifications again. I have a Facebook message. Dusty Chadwick wants to add me as a friend. And if I click it, oh my God, I'm going to Facebook. Let's, try, let's go ahead and confirm Dusty anyway. That's our webmaster. Excuse me, our senior web engineer, whatever he wants to be called. Okay. I had a problem sending a message. I have a new emails at admin at the droid guy dot com and I am the droid guy. And wow, wait for it. There's a Gtalk chat message all in my notification center. And it's all coming to iOS 5. Wait, hold on, there's more. This is the oldest phone that's currently in the Droid Guy offices. It's the HTC Desire. And it's about a year and a half old. And what do you know? A year and a half ago we had a notification center. Wait! I have something ringing. What is it? A reminder just came in. That's another iOS 5 feature. Reminders. And it's a reminder that came in just now and it says quit picking on Apple. I'm sorry. I can't do that right now. Reminders. And the notification center. Brand Let let's go ahead and dismiss the reminder. We really don't need it. Reminders and Notification Center, all brand new in iOS 5. But guess what? We had them first in Android. I'm the Droid Guy. Thanks. But wait, there's more. In iOS 5, check it out. We're on the lock screen. They had quick access on the lock screen to apps. Well, actually, just one app, the camera app. But Android's got more. Phone, mail, camera, messages on at least this HTC Sensation 4G. And any phone with HTC Sense UI 3.0, you can move the icon into the little bubble. And there we go. Quick access to the camera when the phone is locked. Let's try that again, boys and girls. Move it right into the bubble and it's off the lock screen. Quick access to it. But wait, suppose you're in the lock screen and you want to make a phone call? You just put the phone there. Dang, that's that easy. Now, one more time. Try, I want to see my text messages. Text messages. All from the lock screen. Hopefully, we'll see more iOS 5 features later, but this has been an exclusive look at iOS 5 features with the Droid Guy.